Crossroads Fishing! What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Crossroads Fishing. Uh, I just got off work today. Uh, that's why I got my nice little beard line going here from wearing my mask at school all day. Um, for those of you don't, that don't know, I'm a social studies teacher for 6th and 7th grade. I teach world cultures and I teach uh, Texas history, which is a lot of fun. I enjoy both of those. Uh, I love the kids that I teach. But uh, I hate wearing this mask all day because it ruins all this work that I got going in my beard. So, uh, the good news is on my way in, I decided to check the mail and Christmas came in December. Well, Christmas always comes in December. Uh, Christmas is going to come twice in December. So this is my monthly little mystery tackle box that I get. I really, really enjoy it. Uh, it's a lot of fun. So we're going to go through. First thing we get is the Guggen Squad hammer hooks, the... Uh, it's a three out and a four out, so one of each. I've never tried their product, so I am kind of excited to get these because I, I don't know if I ever want to buy them or not. Looks like we're doubling up on the Guggen products for the day, but we've got reflection off this. All right, uh, we've got the Zinger, Guggen Squad Zinger. Uh, what's the color pattern on this? I don't know if their Zingers have a color pattern name to them, but this one is just uh, blue, white, and yellow. Uh, probably not much of a, a fall color, but I do have some places I can throw it where they'll be pretty productive. Um, what else here? We have the 13 Fishing Gordito Crankbait. It's a little long bill crankbait. Uh, it says, that's, this is kind of cool. I'm going to go ahead and open this and let you see it. Uh, I, I love when baits do this. That's one thing I do like about the Guggen Crankbaits. I know a lot of people don't want Guggen's because they don't want to look like fanboys and all that. I just want good products. Um, they actually say on the bill right here, you can see it, seven foot. This thing dives seven foot. So, oh, got some little rattles in there. That's a pretty little crank. I like that. So, it's got the chartreuse and orange kind of blend to it actually it's almost a little transparent you can kind of see through it you can see the the beads moving around and then it's got just a good natural color on top but uh, when the sun is shining I, I bet the sun just like beams off of this thing and I don't know I don't know if it's just really really well made or it's really really cheaply made it's hard to tell but we'll put it to use up next we have I've almost bought these a few times. Uh, I've heard a few people talk about them. The Western Scandinavia uh, stick worms. So they got a good look to them. I don't know how durable they are. These just look like black and blues. Yeah, just little blues with some black peppered flakes in them. And last but not least, we got some Carl's Amazing Baits. Looks like they're kicker crawls. I like these. They're, they're, they're good. They're pretty easy to use. They're not too pricey either. This will be a nice trailer throwing a jig or a buzz bait or we may uh, throw it on the spinner bait whenever we go out to see if we can get it a little extra attention uh, as always you got the paperwork that comes in here one of my favorite things the stickers we got this angry catfish sticker that one's going on the tackle box with the other stuff uh, you got the dribble tips and tricks from the mystery tackle box Carl Dibble did I say dribble? The dibble. Carl Dibble. So it's got some fun tips, things like that that are pretty useful. Uh, I keep them around. I got a nice little pouch that's full of them. If you ever want a good read or just some tips, sometimes it'll give you information. Uh, you always get this card. Tells you how much things cost. That Gordito is a $7 bait. That Guggen Zinger is $6.50. Uh, those Weston stick worms are $6. They're a little pricey. Uh, a lot, you know, a little bit higher than some yum dingers. Uh, the kicker cross from Carl's Amazing Baits is a four dollar pack, and those two hammer hooks from Guggen Squad are a dollar a piece, so two dollars for a three out and a four out. And then you have this. This card is cool too. It always comes with one of the baits that you have. Uh, it basically it talks about this one specifically today or this month. It ta uh, talks about the Guggen Squad zinger, where to fish. Uh, Gear recommendations, you know, it talks about, oh, uh, you want 12 to 20 pound 
fluorocarbon or mono or 30 to 50 pound braid. You want a medium to heavy power rod with fast action. And then uh, it says line again, uh, 15 to 20 fluorocarbon. So a little contradictive, but then you've got, you know, all the different places where it's good to fish in there. So that's it. It's a nice little short and sweet video for today. I uh, just wanted to open up my, my fishing toys that came in, uh, you know, my monthly tackle box. I'm going to start doing one of these every month. I wanted to start doing the mystery tackle box slams, but I just don't have time to get out and fish them all the time like that. And, uh, I don't know. I don't like everything that comes in the mystery tackle box. Sometimes I, you know, give them to my kids so they can fish with them and all that. Uh, I like what I like. And this is just kind of a cool opportunity to try new things, but I'm not going to go out and just do a slam unless there's a box that I just absolutely love and I'm going to do it. But, uh, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up or I'll just babble on. If you like what you see, please give me a thumbs up. And if you really like what you see, click that subscribe button down below and click the bell notificator notificator is that a thing click the little bell option to receive notifications every time we post a new video or go live uh, i actually went live playing a little fishing video game just you know a little uh experiment see if anybody's into that um but yeah so thank you for watching crossroads fishing and we'll see you next time